Hey everybody, got another uh, war base video. All right, so this base has one thing that's pretty unique, um, or, or one thing that you might encounter once in a while. On this base, they put their town center on the edge. Now, it's, it's pretty rare that you find that, but every once in a while, you'll get one that's either on, on the edge inside the walls or on the or, or maybe on the edge outside the walls, like this one is. So, you run into these th this this problem. You got really easy access to it. You can get to it real quick. There's not going to be a, a big long out long drawn out battle that gets you to it. But it's also the town center, which means howitzers and tanks and all kinds of nasty stuff is going to pour out of it. So what you want to be able to do is find some way to safely approach it early on. Well, they gave you an advantage. It's not going to take you a long time to get to it. You just need to get what's inside of it spawned and gone up out of the way before you do your attack so that then you can go ahead and uh, handle um, what comes out of the town center and the town center itself is two separate problems all right so the way I handle this I'll explain it as you see it go down is the artificial intelligence of the game it kind of does two different things okay so one is when a troop gets spawned is determined by um, when one of your troops gets close to it um, when uh, what those troops target is determined by what troop is closest to it. So what I did here was I dropped a single foot soldier. I know he's going to die. The only purpose of dropping him was to get everything there to spawn. I also dropped one here next to the castle. And then I dropped one guy up here. Now the whole purpose of this was to get this stuff spawned and to get it moving. See, the cannons come out. Um, all this has happened. Now, I've, I've used this time to use my demolition to blow some stuff up. And the last thing I'm going to do, I drop a few rifles up here. The only reason I'm dropping one up here is they're just going to keep everything moving. Look, the general's still moving north. Troops are still moving north. And now I can drop my entire body. Now, their howitzer is currently on the way out of the battlefield. My entire forces are laid down. There's nothing really between me and the howitzer except for you know, a building that doesn't have to be destroyed. So very quick, easy take out of the howitzer, quick, easy take out of the town center. My troops are in good shape. They're still strong. Um, I didn't have to rally yet. So now I get to use a rally to concentrate my troops, take out this general extra fast. And now everything is pretty straightforward. It's just running around the base, cleaning up all the various stuff. Um, and when you don't lose a whole lot of troops in the first 30 seconds, your cleanup goes a lot smoother. So just wanted to kind of pass on that little tip. It worked out pretty well for me. Um, but you can go back and watch that again. But basically you can drop a troop or two to cause the spawn. Drop a troop or two in the distance to get those troops to run towards the only thing that's on the battlefield. Use that time to use your tactics. Um, maybe fly an airplane, whatever you've got to do a little bit of damage, some of that other stuff you like to do at the very beginning. Um, and then once they've cleared out of the area, drop your main force and get to work. Hope this helps.